Did you miss me? Because I've missed you. No one wants to play with the clown anymore. What it do, what it do, what it do, you two? It is your boy Hedge back with another video. Um, as y'all can see, I'm in the car right now riding. Um, actually, on the way out of town, taking a little road trip. Um, i get into all that in a minute. Um, first things first, before we really get into this video, man, if you are new to the channel, please, 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 please hit that thumbs up. That's that like button. Um, hit that hit that subscribe button for me and hit that notification bell so you get notified every single time I post. And then if you see something you like, man, share the video. Do that for your boy, share the video. So, um, getting into the video. The reason I am doing this video today is we just hit 10,000 miles. Yes, I said it. We just hit 10,000 miles on the wide body. Now, I know a lot of y'all probably like, damn, bro, you just got it. Well, yes, but this is my daily driver. I drive this car every single day without fail. This car starts every day and it moves out of my garage, out of my driveway every single day without fail. So, with that being said, we finna, I'm gonna let y'all find out. Not we finna find out, because I already know. But I'm finna let y'all um, kind of into my mind a little bit on how I really feel about the car. If I like it still, if I don't, if I feel like, you know, I regret even going to get it, if I want to go get another one, we're gonna get into all that. Um, we're gonna talk about you know some of the some of the things I like about it, some of the things I don't like about it, the features that I hadn't even gotten the chance to really play with yet. We don't get into all that. We don't get into all that. So, um, if 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 I don't touch on something that you want to know or my opinion on anything like that, man, get in the comment section. Let me know. I promise you, you ask me a question, I will answer. I guarantee you that, especially on this video here. I know I ain't the best at responding to the comments and whatnot, but especially on this video here, because I'm I'm telling y'all, I'm asking y'all to do that. So y'all get in the comment section on this video. Ask me anything you want to know. I'm gonna respond to it. Guaranteed. Um so things that I've done already. That was first. Y'all see the speakers back there? I got the seat down. Can y'all see the speaker right there? Right there. That was first. That was like, they, well, technically, technically that wasn't first. That was second. Technically, the tent was first because they did that at the dealership before I even got the keys to it. They tended it for me at the dealership. So, technically, the tent was first. Um, so, the speakers were second. Um, I love my music. Matter of fact, that's why I don't record that much in the car because as y'all can see, it's quiet. It's just me talking to y'all, it's quiet. So, uh, but that would that would have been first if they wouldn't have did the 10 at the dealership. Speaking of, I need this dark enough, like ASAP, because it, it, this, ain't, this ain't dark enough at all. So that's gonna be darker, um, but they, no, they would only go legal at the dealership, so. You know that that's neither here nor there but uh i'm gonna see if i can get it even close even darker and still be legal we'll handle that later um y'all know i did the the the, the low the low partial wrap i'm stuttering this shit. i did the low partial wrap matter of fact let me turn this around let me show y'all something oh my god this little road trip I'm on is doing my little rap dirty. Like real bad. I need to wash it too. I don't know what that white stuff here right now. I need to wash that. I hope it's just, I hope it's not. Whatever. Well, I, I do need to wash it, but it's been raining the last couple days and I'm on a little road trip. So I'll probably wash it when I get to where I'm going. But good Lord. Look at that. Oh my. Oh my. But, <laughs> it, 
to be honest, I knew that wasn't gonna hold up anyway. Um, it hadn't been holding up well at all anytime it get wet, whether I wash it or it rains. So um, I actually already was changing that. I'm pointing to it and y'all can't even see it. Y'all can't see where I'm pointing. But I was already gonna change that. Y'all know what I'm talking about. This is where it says hatch on the hood. So I was already gonna change that. I actually already got it printed and cut um, and ready to go. I just ran out of time before needing to leave this morning, last night slash this morning. So it's not on here yet, which if I'm being honest, it's probably for the best. Cause I didn't want to throw it on here and then take the road trip and then that one get messed up. Cause I've been real mad about that. But uh, when I when I when I get back to the house, that will be a little different. Obviously, as I do with everything, eventually I'm gonna let y'all see it. I actually I actually might do a video while I'm installing it. I got I got to do another video anyway on all this stuff, man. I was up all night, man. We'll talk about that later. Um, actually, no, we're gonna talk about that right now, man. If y'all need anything made, your boy been busy. Um, just finished. Uh, jerseys for for the uh men's league basketball team um that'll be on another video because i need to start you know showing that stuff anyway um we be doing i say we me and my wife we be doing um custom pretty much anything y'all want a wine glass we can do it the glitter sayings all that we can do it you want a tumbler we can do it glitter sayings whatever color you want uh teams whatever characters all that um you need a mask we can do it uh, y'all, y'all smoke, y'all need trays, we can do that too. Wood grain, whatever you want. You want a picture of your face on the tray, we can do that. Um, matter of fact, I'm gonna put it right here. Um, on Instagram, I'll put it in the description too. But on Instagram, if you go to our business page, it's One Stop Customs. That's the number one. One Stop Customs with a Z. Um, I'm gonna put it right here, and the link will be in the description below, man. Um, y'all can go on there. I need, it. I actually really need to do better about posting on there because we really be working all the time. And I mean, y'all know how I do on social media. I don't post that much. But um, I will get better about posting on there because there's a lot of stuff in my house that need to go. Like, now need to go. Stuff that we was playing with that's already done that if you wanted to walk up to me today and say, hey, I want that, you can have it today. Like, that's how it needs to go. Like, they already ready. They just need to go. They need a home. Um, so, yeah back to what we was talking about before that um so i got that it's already cut ready to go i just didn't put it on because of this trip it's raining this and that the third ran out of time you know we'll, we'll, uh, a whole bunch of reasons why i put that on here but um the next time not the next time because it'll probably be a couple times that y'all seen me before that song because i don't know how long we're gonna be out here but uh when i do when i get back home that'll be back on that's gonna be changed so That'd be good to go. I'm definitely let y'all see that. I done, done the lights. Um, got my lights through lighting trends. That Blue Coast controller is a fool. I know y'all done seen the video on my Instagram. Um, I know Hemi Life got the same controller. Bruh, that Blue Ghost controller is a fool. I recommend, first of all, everybody get lights. If you get the lights, the lights make a big difference. Um, and then when you do, get that Blue Ghost controller. Do it. If you're on the fence about it, do it. I'm a, let me push you over. Do it. So definitely do that. Um, I actually just got another mod. Uh, my wife got me for, as an anniversary gift. I'm not going to tell y'all what that is yet because it's not on. Um, but I probably will do an install video on that because I want to see if I can do it myself. So um, I'll let y'all see. Eventually, I'll let y'all see what it is. And uh, me attempting, because we don't know how it's going to go, attempting to put it on. What else, what else, what else, what else, what else? As far as, um, you know, modifications, that's pretty much it. You know, it's all been, you know, a couple of parents mods. I mean, I got, you know, a couple of decals. I got the Instagram on the window, YouTube on the back. Um, but other than that, that's really it. Um, as far as mods go, I ain't touched the engine yet. Oh, before I forget, my old wheels are for sale. I remember the ones that was on Pennywise. They um they regularly black. Right now they they dipped in red. Um, so currently they red, but underneath they're red. They are black. 
Um, I only had them like not even six months, man. I got them at, for my birthday last July, and y'all know I bought this car in December, so barely six months. Not even 5,000 miles. I'm tire still good, not a single burnout or anything. Burnout, power slide, none of that done at all. Um, so those are for sale. If you go on my Instagram, I got a little video up there. Matter of fact, I'm gonna plug that video in right here too, so all y'all can see it. But those are for sale. I have not touched the engine yet. That will come eventually, probably, maybe, most likely, I don't know. But I haven't done it yet. Um, really, if y'all got some suggestions on what to do as far as engine mods, let me know. Cause I don't even know where I want to start at yet. So y'all let me know. Like when I say that nothing, everything under there is still stock. Still stock. Eventually I'm gonna throw some color under there and get it painted. Whatever the case may be, I might do that myself because I'm a DIYer. Um, but I ain't even got like stock, stock, no cold or anything, nothing. It's all stock down there. Um, yeah, okay, so we 10,000 in. As far as maintenance goes, nothing really yet. Um, two oil changes, which if you're following the schedule, you're supposed to do them every four or 5,000 miles anyway. So two oil changes and uh two new rear tires um whew, them rear tires well the tires that come on here anyway these pirelli um p0 that come on these cars man if y'all buy one of these cars brand new we just got them pirelli p0 the only thing they're good for is burning them out because them tires suck like suck suck um ever since i changed them i got well before i changed them i was sliding everywhere i couldn't I couldn't, you know, hit the gas mediumly, you know, hard, aggressively, and without sliding. That's just, it's just a soft rubber, man. Um, and if, you, if you're going to a tire shop, they'll tell you the same thing. They, they really a soft rubber. They're more so for a, a smooth ride and not necessarily um, durability uh, as, as far as the tire is concerned. So, First thing you need to do is change the tires. Um, I mean, that, we, we really say that anyway, especially if you get anything, you know, with a Hemi in it, because if it come with 245, 265 on the back, that is not gonna be enough as far as traction goes. Um, and that's really just become a safety issue. Okay, little Corvette, little Stingray. That's really more of a safety issue, but um, the wide bodies, they come with 20 by 11 uh, wheels, so they got 305s all the way around. So as far as, you know, width of the tire, it's very good. But as far as the quality of that tire, I don't know why they cost so much. Um, especially on a sports car. Um, but the tires I have on now, I got some Continentals on here now. I have, I don't slide at all. Um, I'm not, you know, burning them on accident. Like even with the traction off, it's not like they're just, they're just a more durable of a tire. So first thing you need to do, especially as far as safety is concerned, is change the tires. Uh, let's see. There is, let me turn this one. So y'all can see I'm using my navigation because I have no idea where I'm going. So I gotta do this real quick because I gotta step out and then I gotta do something different. But um, let's just go straight to the performance pages. To the performance pages. Um, one of my biggest likes about these performance pages, one of my biggest dislike is it takes forever to load, as you can see. But um, one of the things that I really like about these performance pages is the dyno. The dyno. Like, you see what you're doing at all times if you want to. If, you're in, if you know what you're looking at, then you understand why this is a cool little feature to have in the car. Uh, another thing, these gauges. Is it these? Not what I'm looking for. I'm looking for. 
I mean, gotta work. Let me see. What's on the home? This one I'm looking for. I got it on my home page. This right here. Tell you how much horsepower you're using at any given time. So if I get off the gas, right now I'm off the gas. See? Off the gas, zero horsepower. I get back on the gas, it moves with it. Now, I know that they say these cars come stock at 485. Me personally, on this little gauge right here, on that little gauge I just showed you, I've seen 518 stock. So I don't know if 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 they just lied, if that 485 is, I ain't gonna say that they just lied. I don't know if that 485 is a, like a roundabout number uh, or, you know, what the, what the goal is, but mine definitely does more than 485. Um, I don't know if y'all can see my look. Uh, my look, I ain't even feel. I'm gonna move it out the way. I wouldn't use it anyway because I got it plugged in. I'm using navigation. But as y'all can see, I don't know if y'all can see. Maybe you can. What you see is real cloudy. It's been raining a little bit, so I ain't been doing too much. But um, let me see if I can. Let me go to drive modes real quick. We'll put this thing in sport. And let me see. Do a little pull. Once I get open it, cause I ain't trying to run into no cops. I'm do a little pull. I'ma um, see what the what the horsepower go to. Make sure y'all watch it. I got a straight, look like a little straightaway coming up. And I'm in this lane by myself, so watch that. Yes, I still got the plastic on it. Don't talk about it. You can see through it. What I thought I was, it's over a little hill. Let me see what we got when we get over this little hill. On my fan anyway. I'm gonna definitely do a little pull. So I can see what this what this HP get to. Probably need to drop a couple gears, but and oh well. Well, well, it's gonna drop anyway when I step on it. It's in eighth right now, as you can see right there too. It's we in eight right now. It's gonna drop a couple when I step on it. Fuck it. Here we go. I was over 100 because I got off. Y'all heard me get off of it. We was still at 99. Um, I'm gonna have to put that in the slow motion to see really what it got to. But I'm almost positive I saw more than 485. I mean, don't no, no quote me, but I am gonna you know slow it down and we gonna see. We definitely gonna see. But uh, no matter how you spin it, no matter how you put it, it's a lot more power than what I came from. I will say that it's a big difference. Um, let's see what else. Uh, I definitely the body. Oh my goodness! Love the way this car look. Um, I, I'm gonna suggest everybody if you buy a if you buy a charger, go get a wide body. Shoot, if you buy a Challenger, go get a wide body. If you buy anything, go get a wide body. It's it's just. I'm gonna be honest. When when I first got into Chargers, it was a long time ago. Long 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 time ago. I didn't like the 15 16 models because to me they didn't look as aggressive as the previous one but you add the wide body it just starts sitting up like a pit bull and it look a lot more aggressive so i definitely love the body on it um see what do i not like about it um first and foremost the payment <laughs> i mean it's not ridiculous but just the simple fact of having the bacon is uh, i mean if i could if we could all have a car for free then i'm sure everybody would be happy right when nobody complained about not having to make the payment but yeah so that's number one number two the gas i'm at the gas station like every two to three days i'm talking about i can go and fill up and remember I told y'all I drive this, it's my daily. I drive this car every day. I can go and fill up today and do what I need to do. And by Wednesday, 
Thursday at the latest, I'm back at the gas station. It's ridiculous. Like, come on now. I I, I need something else. And, and we ain't drinking no regular. This is just thing here, just eating expensively. This is, look here, it is the cream of the crop, right? We got whatever your, whatever your favorite hot dollar liquor is, that's what I put in this gas tank. And we ain't doing no Coronas. We ain't doing no beers at all. We ain't doing no Patron, right? If you want to go to liquor, we ain't doing no Patron. Whatever your favorite hot dollar liquor is, that's what we putting in here. And to do that every like three days or so, whew, pockets hurt a little bit. But I knew that going in, so I can't really be mad at nobody but myself about it, but it don't mean I have to like it, right? And to be honest, that's pretty much all I don't like about it. Like I am still 100% in love with this car. Um, if I could do it all over again, I would go and order it the same exact way with the, the red interior just like this. Like, I would order it the same exact way. If a thousand times again, I would order this car the exact same way. So, again, this is just my opinion. If you're on the fence, if you're looking at one, go get it. Like, right now. What you waiting on? Why you still sitting there? Go get the car. Get right now. But yeah, so um, that's gonna be a wrap for this one. Just wanted to get on here and talk to y'all a little bit, let y'all uh, you know see what my experience has been these first ten thousand miles in the car. Uh, and like when I say we just hit ten thousand, I've been on the road what an hour, an hour and a half, if not a little longer, and we had ten thousand seventy nine. So it, like I said, we just hit that ten thousand. Whoa, where am I supposed to be going? We just hit 10,000, so um, it's been a journey. Here's the 10,000 mo, 20,000 mo, 120,000 mo, however long we gonna go. 287 North, yes. Y'all, I wish y'all could see what I really just did. It's probably, these people probably looking at me like I'm crazy. Cause I literally have, this the road just split, I have no idea where I'm going, the GPS be a little confusing and all that, but you know, we gonna get there, we gonna get there safely. There's another reason I'm gonna put this phone down. But um, like I said, man, if you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button, hit that like button. Um, if you don't follow my personal Instagram, it's underscore ask me later. That's in the uh, description below. I'm gonna put the, that. I mean, I said it's my personal. It's my personal one. It's mostly my car, but it's my personal one. Um, and then the business one. If y'all need anything custom done, anything like, trust me, there's not a lot that we can't do. You need anything done, go to One Stop Customs. One Stop Customs. That's the number one customs with a Z. One Stop Customs on Instagram. DM me. And, you know, if you got an idea, we're going to put something together. If you don't, then let me operate. We're going we're gonna to get you something that you're going to love. Um, so, with that being said, man, until next time, because y'all finna get another video as soon as I get to where I'm going. So, until next time, man, y'all stay locked in.